L.A. Rider is brought to you by Dudley DeBosier Injury Lawyers, serving Louisiana motorcyclists and their families for nearly two decades. Dudley DeBosier, official injury lawyers for the Motorcycle Awareness Campaign. When you're on a motorcycle, you got to look out for all kinds of stuff. But after a crash, it's a danger you can't see that can really get you. The insurance company is working behind the scenes to deny you compensation. They're building a case against you, but at Deli DeBosier, we're working for you. Keep your head on a swivel. Let these guys look out for you. Motorcycle crash? Demand different. Demand Dudley DeBosier. 444-4444. Hello and welcome to LA Rider, Louisiana's only television show devoted entirely to motorcycle lifestyles, travel, and adventure. I'm T.W. Robinson and we're so excited you're joining us today. This week we take another ride to Arnaville for lunch at another great restaurant in this Cajun town of only a thousand people. Tammy Arinder heads across the border into Arkansas for a visit to Beach Street Bistro and we preview this year's Nation of Patriots passing of the flag ride. All this and much more on this edition of LA Rider. So twist that throttle and let's take a ride. Welcome back. I'm T.W. and this is L.A. Rider. So glad you're joining us again. We're at Jean Gonzalez in Baton Rouge where the second annual motorcycle awareness ride is underway. More on that later, but right now, let's take a ride to Cajun country. It had only been three days since my visit to the Little Big Cup in Arnaville, and here I was again, retracing my route to that rural Cajun community which straddles two parishes. It was a beautiful day as Red Rider and I roared down US Highway 190 through West Baton Rouge and Point Capee parishes and across the upper Atchafalaya Basin. Shortly after posting a story on Facebook about my visit to the Little Big Cup, several people reached out and suggested that I check out another restaurant in a small town of a thousand people. As you know, the promise of good food is always a reason to ride, and of course riding always makes me hungry. For me, it is the motorcycle circle of life. Myron's is located on the southern edge of Arnoville's cultural district and backs up to Bayou Tesh. There's plenty of parking and some of it is covered. A big bonus for motorcycles on a hot day. There's ample seating inside, but I chose a table on the rear deck so I could enjoy a view of the bayou. Bayou Tesh is a 125 mile waterway which runs from Port Barry to Patterson, Louisiana. 4,000 years ago, it was a main course of the Mississippi River. Myron's has been serving up great food here on the bayou since 1979. There's something for everyone on the menu, from barbecue chicken and steaks to sandwiches, po' boys, and seafood dinners. They also have all sorts of appetizers, but I heard their fried onion rings were to die for. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> like a nose ring, did <laughs> Oh, my God. Tammy would be so jealous because you know how she loves homemade onion ring. Mmm. <laughs> These are wonderful. I had barely polished off those onion rings when the main course arrived. A fried shrimp po' boy for me and a shrimp 
fish and oyster combo plate for Bob. Let me see, this is a lot, this is a lot. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That is great. That's a lot, but it ain't too much for me. Another winner to add to my collection of great shrimp po' boys. Mm. And Bob says the combo platter was fantastic. Although I gobbled up most of the shrimp on it while he was busy shooting video. <laughs> well, I'm adding this shrimp, fried shrimp pull boy to my list of great pull boys. And who would have thought in Arnaville they would have two great restaurants? Next time you're out for a ride, you need to try Myron's. It is really good. Arnaville is a relatively small town, but when it comes to food, it has a big reputation. Check it out. Stay with us. More L.A. Rider is coming your way right after this. L.A. Rider is brought to you by the Motorcycle Awareness Campaign a 501c3 nonprofit organization exclusively dedicated to promoting motorcycle awareness and rider safety throughout Louisiana and the nation. I didn't see him. She just came out of nowhere. Oh God, what am I gonna do? Watch for us. See us. 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 Save us. Improve your skills. Make U-turns with ease. Tighten your corners and ride with more confidence and greater control. Sign up now for Cajun Thunder's Motorcycle Skills Training Course taught by police instructor Mike Richard and Amanda Joe at Cajun Thunder's state-of-the-art facility in Ponchatoula. Take your riding skills to the next level with Cajun Thunder's Rider Advancement Training. I didn't see him. She just came out of nowhere. Oh God, what am I gonna do? Watch for us. See us. 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 Watch for us. Save us. us. Please, watch for motorcycles. I'm TW and we're here at Road Dog Custom Motorcycles where the Nation of Patriots are having a fundraiser. Well, we're doing our first fundraiser for 2023 Nation of Patriots Patriot Tour. We kind of like to kick off event for the entire tour. Rob's been working with us now for a couple of years on this. It's a great event. We get some great support from the community. Just proud to be part of this organization. And this year, Patriot Tour will launch next Saturday from Papillon, Nebraska, go through all 50 states, end up back in Papillon in September, about mid-September, and we're hoping nationwide we can raise over 300000 this year for uh, disabled veterans. So tell me what this does for veterans. For we provide financial relief to disabled veterans that are in need, and it might be something as simple as they need to get their vehicle fixed because they need transportation, uh, they might need home repairs, some kind of debt relief, and that's where we step in to try to fill that gap for them. Um, we work pretty much in conjunction with the VA, so we identify the proper veterans that we need to get this uh, financial relief to. So generally, uh, rule of thumb, they have to be disabled in the VA system, have at least one dependent, and we look for like 50% of disability or above for them to qualify for a grant. And there's a process they go through, they apply for the grant, the board of directors, the executive board reviews it, and then it's approved, and then we do whatever they need to uh, have done. Oh, this is a, a great event that I'm proud to be a part of for the second year in a row. This is a, a jambalaya cook-off for the Nation of Patriots. Um, for those who don't know what that is, it is a, uh, a group of volunteers that take an American flag and it gets passed from dealer to dealer, every Harley-Davidson dealership in the United States until its final resting place. And in the meantime, uh, they raise money for disabled veterans. So all of the proceeds 
uh, go towards helping disabled vets. So my father was a World War II veteran, so I have a soft spot in my heart for that. And, uh, you know, we support our troops. You know, it's that simple. You know, that's what makes this the greatest country in the world. We expect so much from our men and women in uniform. It's up to us to try to, you know, help them when they need help. Because they come back and it's limited what they get from the federal government. So right. it's, it's really great we can kind of fill that void for them. For the best in restorative and cosmetic dental care, choose Dr. Jason Hutto. Your smile is important and so is your overall oral health. And at the dental office of Jason Hutto, our aim is to provide the highest quality dental care. From implants and cosmetic procedures to fillings, root canals, and cleaning, choose Dr. Jason Hutto. Hi, I'm Jason Hutto. Call for your appointment today. But not on Fridays. That's the day we ride. Improve your skills. Make U-turns with ease. Tighten your corners and ride with more confidence and greater control. Sign up now for Cajun Thunder's Motorcycle Skills Training Course taught by Police Instructor Mike Richard and Amanda Joe at Cajun Thunder's state-of-the-art facility in Ponchatoula. Take your riding skills to the next level with Cajun Thunder's Rider Advancement Training. At G and Gonzalez, we do it all, from really big to the really small. Keeping you safe? No problem. We have the latest AOT racing gear found exclusively at G and Gonzalez. Don't monkey around. Head on down to G and Gonzalez of Baton Rouge, where the fun begins. For more than 40 years, Robert Rad Leonard has provided South Louisiana motorcyclists with all their needs, from a showroom jam-packed with all the latest gear to a full-service shop featuring skilled technicians who handle everything from routine service to complete engine rebuilds. Rad Cycles also carries a huge selection of pre-owned models and has the area's largest inventory of used bike parts. For all your riding needs, do what South Louisiana motorcyclists have been doing since 1978. Go Rad. Rad Cycles. They're rider recommended. Looking for a trailer? Check out Mike Gerald's Trailer Depot. At Mike's two Baton Rouge locations, you'll find a huge inventory of high-quality motorcycle trailers, boat trailers, cargo trailers, utility trailers, and custom-built trailers. Plus, the largest inventory of trailer parts and accessories in the area. Can't find that perfect trailer? Let Mike build one for you. Mike Gerald's Trailer Depot. Two locations in Baton Rouge to serve you. They're rider recommended. Want a high quality used motorcycle delivered to your door with a money back guarantee? At usedbikesdirect.com you can choose from hundreds of high quality American, Japanese and European motorcycles. Just browse our website, pick your bike, get your financing and arrange your trade in. All from the comfort of your home. And we'll deliver it straight to your door for free. Complete with a 30 day money back guarantee. Buying a used motorcycle has never been easier or safer. Just go to usedbikesdirect.com and start shopping. Welcome back to LA Rider. I'm Tammy Orinder. We are here at Warhawk Harley Davidson in Monroe, and they're about to get ready for a poker run today, so a lot of activity here. Well, while out riding and exploring, you know me, I found another great place to eat. Not only does it have good food, it's a good ambiance, and some good blues music to ride across the state line and cross it, and it's called Beach Street Bistro. Oh. The blues music emanating from the Beach Street Bistro in Crossit is only rivaled by the aroma coming from the kitchen. That is crawfish and chicken and Koneka sausage and heavy cream and Velveeta and thick sliced mushrooms. Chester Huntsman can belt out the ingredients to his crawfish pie the way he can belt out a blues song. We tried to look like a Mississippi juke joint but we have the heart of a Cracker Barrel. Huntsman, the brother of the late Johnny Huntsman, founder of Johnny's Pizza, has taught his staff to cook the way he likes to cook, from rich and creamy mac and cheese to hand-battered, with a little help from this contraption, onion rings. Pam Riley says she loves everything on the menu, but is especially crazy about the crawfish pie. 
it's just full of everything chicken sausage crawfish and the flavor is just out of this world now chester loaded me up with what he calls his signature dishes i'm gonna try this pork chop sandwich <laughs> no d in there right just just no, sandwich Mmm. When I leave here, I'm going to be the size of a small school bus, and I don't even care. <laughs> you can drink in the ambiance of the creative decor. Is it a blues bar, minus the alcohol, or is it a Creole cottage? These girls, Denise Morris and Sheila Dickerson, did all. And if you feel a little something different when you walk into this place, it could be the prep work before the doors even open, or should I say prayer work. Pray in Jesus' name. Amen. For God to give us the opportunity to come in, and for all the people that come in, they leave here thinking, that was great. We got to be a blessing to people, and that's absolutely what it's all about. Don't you just love that place? Now, they don't have music every Thursday night, but you can go on their Facebook page or their website and find out when their next live music and entertainment's going to be at Beach Street Bistro. But even if they're not having music, it is a wonderful place to go eat. Back with more LA Rider in just a moment. I didn't see him. Watch for us. She just came out of nowhere. See us. Oh God, what am I gonna do? Save us. Please, watch for motorcycles. You might just save someone's life. Motocross? We've got it at Gian Gonzalez in Baton Rouge. All the bikes, all the gear, and the expertise to help make you number one at the track. From beginner to expert, we've got just what you need at Gian Gonzalez in Baton Rouge. Come see us today at Gian Gonzalez, Louisiana's oldest family-owned power sports dealer. Located in downtown Baton Rouge in the shadow of the state capitol. Race on down to Gian Gonzalez. Becoming number one starts here. We're waiting for you! I didn't see him. Watch for us. She just came out of nowhere. See us. Oh God, what am I going to do? Save us. Please, watch for motorcycles. You might just save someone's life. Just putting on leather and sitting on a bike doesn't make someone a biker. And it's easy to tell the posers from the pros. Same goes for law firms. Just because someone's a lawyer doesn't mean they know motorcycle cases. At Deli de Bossier, we've been fighting for injured bikers all over Louisiana for years. After a crash, get experience on your side. Call Dudley de Bossier. Motorcycle crash? Demand different. Demand Dudley de Bossier. 444-4444. Support motorcycle safety and encourage other drivers to watch for motorcycles. Purchase a motorcycle awareness specialty plate for your car, truck, or motorcycle. For an additional $25 a year, you can help the Motorcycle Awareness Campaign promote safety, awareness, and training programs throughout Louisiana. I'm T.W. Robinson. No matter what you ride, put a mat plate on it and help support motorcycle awareness wherever you go. Improve your skills. Make U-turns with ease. Tighten your corners and ride with more confidence and greater control. Sign up now for Cajun Thunder's Motorcycle Skills Training Course taught by Police Instructor Mike Richard and Amanda Joe at Cajun Thunder's state-of-the-art facility in Ponchatoula. Take your riding skills to the next level with Cajun Thunder's Rider Advancement Training. At Jandy Imports, we have everything for your ride. From high quality leather jackets, vests, and chaps, to saddlebags, luggage, and riding boots. We have a large selection of helmets, too, and feature a full line of Amsoil and Bike Care products. At Jandy Imports, you'll find the area's largest selection of patches, all sewn on for you while you wait. You need it? We've got it. At Jandy Imports, the, the little, little store with the big inventory. Come see us at Jandy Imports.
Like most people who ride, I look forward to holidays. Give me good weather and a three-day weekend, and you can be sure I'll be out on the road riding at least two of those three days. Looking for a bigger burger, a new road to ride, or an unusual destination. But on Memorial Day weekend, it wasn't food, or a road, or even a destination that was on my mind. It was a number, and that number was 1.1 million. That's how many Americans have died in battle since the American Revolution. 1.1 million soldiers have gone off to war and never returned. That's what Memorial Day is really about. So on this Memorial Day weekend, I decided to forego the search for food, new roads, and unusual destinations, and instead pointed Red Rider in a different direction. My first stop was the state capitol building in Baton Rouge, where I found a stunning temporary memorial to Louisiana's fallen heroes. There were more than 11,000 flags planted here, each one representing a Louisiana citizen killed in battle since the Civil War. The memorial, which was placed by the Blue Star Mothers, is a vivid representation of those who have made the ultimate sacrifice for their country. Next, a short 19-mile ride north to the Port Hudson National Cemetery, just off US 61 on the edge of East Baton Rouge Parish. The siege of Port Hudson was one of the key battles of the Civil War, and a costly one. Nearly 5,000 Union troops died during the 48-day siege, and many of them are buried here. Today, the cemetery contains the graves of more than 12,000 servicemen and women and is one of the largest national cemeteries in Louisiana. The final leg of my pause and reflect ride took me another 18 miles to the northeast and the Louisiana War Veterans Home in Jackson. The state of Louisiana operates five veterans homes and the Jackson facility was the first. On this Memorial Day weekend, I decided to drop by and say thank you to some of the residents who just happened to be enjoying an impromptu after lunch concert. Thank to you, I'm always on till closing time. I got swinging doors, you and the bars too. While I can't personally thank the 1.1 million Americans who gave their lives for us, I certainly can thank those who put their lives on the line along with them and managed to make it safely back home. In the end, they are all heroes, aren't they? And they deserve our respect, our honor, and our thanks each and every day. I love me some race cars. Do you want to go in the race car with me next week? Absolutely. You got one? No, but I'm thinking about You're gonna it. You're going to get one? <laughs> <laughs> The big focus here today at Jean Gonzalez is on motorcycle safety, and MAC, the Motorcycle Awareness Campaign, hosted the second annual awareness ride. I'm Bob Courtney. Riders began rolling into Gian Gonzalez Motorsports in Baton Rouge early on Saturday morning for the second annual awareness ride. The event is sponsored by the Motorcycle Awareness Campaign, a 501c3 nonprofit whose sole mission is motorcycle safety and awareness. 
Mac was formed more than 20 years ago in an effort to reduce the number of motorcycle crashes and fatalities caused by distracted and inattentive motorists. The annual awareness ride takes place during National Motorcycle Safety and Awareness Month each year and is an effort to call attention to motorcycles on the highway and introduce motorcyclists to Mac. Riders were given cards which had to be punched at five locations on the ride. Other motorcycle dealers and shops participating in the ride were Friendly Power Sports in Baton Rouge, Cajun Thunder Motorsports and Training in Ponchatoula, Law Enforcement Motorcycle Specialties in Walker, and Road Dog Custom Motorcycles in Prairieville. After making the loop, riders returned to G and Gonzalez for their final punch and then placed all the cards in a hopper for a drawing. Then they enjoyed free food and drinks and music by the Eddie Smith Band. When all the cards were in, Gian Gonzalez owner Linda Gonzalez drew 14 names. Over $2,000 in cash and prizes were donated by L.A. Rider and Gian Gonzalez, including a $1,000 cash prize put up by L.A. Rider. Patricia Burns. Patricia Burns. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The awareness ride is just one of many events Mac stages throughout the year to call attention to motorcycles on our highways. If you want to know more about Mac or join in its efforts to make our roads safer, just go to macorg.com. That's M A C O R G.com. Motorcycle Awareness Month only comes around once a year, but Mac's mission to save lives takes place every day. Please help us make every day Motorcycle Safety and Awareness Day. Watch for motorcycles. I'm T.W. Robinson. Thanks for joining us today. We'll be back next week, same time, same channel, for another great edition of L.A. Rider. As always, we haven't been everywhere, but it's on our list. See you next week for more L.A. Rider. L.A. Rider is brought to you by Dudley DeBosier Injury Lawyers, serving Louisiana motorcyclists and their families for nearly two decades. Dudley DeBosier, official injury lawyers for the Motorcycle Awareness Campaign. When you're on a motorcycle, you got to look out for all kinds of stuff. But after a crash, it's a danger you can't see that can really get you. The insurance company is working behind the scenes to deny you compensation. They're building a case against you, but at Deli DeBosier, we're working for you. Keep your head on a swivel. Let these guys look out for you. Motorcycle crash? Demand different. Demand Dudley DeBosier. 444-4444. God bless Chrome Cowgirls like us.